Hey guys, welcome to WordPress Tips and Tricks. Today, we will explore the Elementor Flexbox container element width adjustment issue and how to solve it. First, let's address the issue. Create a Flexbox container inside your page and then drag any widget. Suppose the image widget inside the container. Now, Elementor made the flex box to make it easier to adjust the dimension of any element in it. If we hover to the right edge of the image, we can see an adjustment cursor popping up. If you click it, or just click and drag it towards the other end, the object will decrease in size. It's very easy to do and super convenient to use with Flexbox. You can continue making adjustments as much as you want. The same applies when you try to increase the size again. But here's the catch. You can't restore it to the maximum size it was at the start. If you think it's a critical issue, you are wrong. Even if you go into the inspect mode, you won't find anything wrong. But if you go into the advanced tab for the image widget, you will see that the new width option inside there has been changed. This is the trick actually. When you are changing the width in the editor by dragging, you are changing the custom width here. If you simply set it back to default, the original size will be restored immediately. And if you want to change the width, simply select custom width and then adjust the values with precision. And that's not all. Going into the container layout option, if you increase the width of the box container, the image will expand up to 1200 pixels and stop growing even if you increase the width to 1600 pixels. Even after selecting full width, the image won't bulge. So, how to make the content full width? To do that, let's click on the image. Go into the style part and change the image width or max width value to the maximum and see the result. Now, the element will cover the full width of the container. And also, you can adjust the container width itself but this time, it will move along with the image being full width. And if you try to drag the sides to expand the element, it will instead expand the container in full width mode. And you can easily change the width directly from the container option, no need to touch the image itself. This can be a bit tricky for anyone with previous experience with Elementor sections and columns or new users. So this video could help you grasp the controls a bit better. That's the end of the video. Make sure to like, subscribe, and follow our channel to get more tips and tricks videos. See you soon.